Good morning and welcome back to my little corner of the internet. It's currently 9 a.m. and I have to meet later at school, so I thought I would film this video already so I can edit it when I get home. Um, that's always nice being a little out in the future, so I have um, my Friday morning off instead. It would be nice. So let's just get started. I have a spring haul for you today because I have the last past week for the couple of things so I thought I would show them to you and let's start with beauty because I have it all right here <laughs> so let's just get started I did an order from feelunique.com and it's my second time ordering from there and I'm always really happy what, with the order I make and how fast I get here and the things I buy from there is really really good um, so I would really check Feel Unique out if you uh, have some beauty things you need to shop for so the first thing I got was this Bourjois 1-2-D Perfect CC Cream and it's just a light base, not a foundation but a CC cream, you know, a light moisturizer. So I'm really happy about that. I think I will get a lot of use out of this because my skin is okay so I don't really need a lot of cover but when I want to do a little extra I think this will be good. And I got a concealer because I needed a new under eye concealer. I'm not having makeup on today because it's a really bad day. It's not raining but it's really grey and uh, outside and it's cold so I'm just wearing a sweater and yeah. So I don't know what it had to do with this. Yo, know, it was because I didn't want to put makeup on and just have a chill day. Anyway, this concealer here is really really good but I would get a powder I think to set it because I think sometimes it goes a little the way it wants to do itself so and I also got a beauty blender and this is not a beauty blender it's from Will Technique so it's not the real beauty blender but I like this size better um, and I what I do is I use this flat end for all over my skin and dab 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 and then I use this round in to my concealer. So, oh, I don't. I just use this the way I want to use it when I have it. But you just damp it and squeeze it a couple of times, and that's really good. And then I also got some eye makeup because I got an eyeshadow kit from Tanya Burr and. I needed some new eyeshadows. I only have like neutral colors and a red. <laughs> so I thought I would try out this one and it's also pretty neutral. It has these colors and I think it's really pretty but a little bit different. And I need want to I haven't tried this yet, but it's really really pretty. It's so beautiful and I need to try it out because I have a huge formal event this I actually have two in the upcoming month, so I need to figure out how I want to do this but it's really really pretty it has a light and then you have like two beige lilac ish colors and then a black one and they're really pretty and it has a good size mirror because I don't have mirrors in any of my other things so it's really nice that it has that also from Tanya Burr there was a like three for two kind of things so I got two nail pol polishes and this one I showed in my other video is a really nice bright pink color and it's perfect for spring and summer in general. Summer it will be perfect because it makes you look so tan like I showed that in my other video. Go check that out if you don't trust me because it makes me look tanner and in the summer that would be really nice to look even more tan. And then I got a pale blue grayish color and I think that would be really pretty also for my formal events I have this month. And that's actually why I bought it but I haven't tried yet. Because I'm, my nails is really bad, so I'm trying to build them up again before I put nail polish on for the events. So these two. Oops. Oh, and the grey color is called David Day, and this one is called Bright and Early. Mm -hmm. I also got two lip products. Um, I got this one from Rimmel London from their Only One collection, and this one is called Naughty Nude in 700. And it's just a really pretty pale brownish with a red undertone. 
I don't know how to explain it, but I really like this color and I've been looking for it for a long time, but it's apparently the color that sell out the fastest, so I was really happy when I found it on the Unique and I already smashed it because so I, you can see it, but it is a giant, like, it just cut off in a really wrong place because I just smashed the, the other part uh, into it and then I might be... I might have been a little drunk when I did that. Moving on to the next little product. It's a completely different color. It's This is bright orange. It's from NYX, the Soft Matte Lip Cream. And let me just tell you, this is the softest thing I have ever had on my lips. When you apply, you're like, oh my god, this is so soft. And then you go do like this, and it's so soft. And then, without you even noticing, noticing it, it's just matte and you can't feel it on your lips. It's so, so good. But I would recommend like putting a lip balm or and a lip line underneath because um, maybe a lip balm definitely because it can be quite drying if you have dry lips or your lips tend to go dry when you wear lip products like mine. So I would really wear something underneath that. And I also got something to remove makeup because I needed new things. Um, so I got this one here, micellar cleansing water. And I got this, the pink one, because I already have the blue one and I wanted to try the pink out, but I don't think that's a big difference, to be honest. And I also got the wipes, but they are downstairs and the bedroom, so I can use them there. But, um, yeah. Cleansing water is always good, always good, and this one is really, really good. I just feel like it does the job, and I don't feel like I have a lot on my skin, and uh, it's just nice afterwards. So, I would recommend that if you're looking for a new makeup, remover. So I also got a few things in fashion wise so let's just start with yeah so I got a yellow bag ah, like this um, and it's just like this and I don't know I just feel like this is really pretty <laughs> and I would use it a little this a lot for spring and summer because it has the perfect size. I actually think I can fit my Polaroid camera down there. That would be perfect because it's always annoying. I can't really have my Polaroid camera with me. But I think I can fit both my vlogging and Polaroid and my wallet and my phone and you know all the things you have in a bag. And then it's yellow and I always I only have black bags. I don't I don't even have a white or brown one. I don't know what's wrong with me. But I, it was just funny with a pop of color and I think I will go for this from now on because it's just funnier to have a little co color. And this was from H&M and it was like 12 or 13 pounds, something around there. It's in Kunal near two Danish crowns, 129 Danish crowns. Wondering. I also had an order from ASUS and I got three things but I only have two of them here to show you. So the first one is this skirt and it has it's just this pale grey beige pinkish color and it has this it's A-line and it has this little lace not a lace but you know what I mean like this fringe and I like a wave at the bottom and it's really really pretty I really like this and I've always been used to this, that's why I have it here, because it's in my closet. And I also got a dress in a fresh and spring summer color, so it's just like this. And it stops right above the knees, and then you tie it in the back there, like so. Tie it, and it fits me so nicely, I really really like it. And I'm actually going to wear this to uh, another formal event, one of the formal events, but it's more like a summer party kind of thing. It's still really formal, but it's not that formal and I can't wear a summer dress. I will have a lot more about the formal events up on my blog because it's a Danish thing, so it will need some explanation. Um, but I will wear one of these, so I'm not wearing it yet, but I think this will also be perfect just as an everyday dress with a denim jacket over, or you can dress it up with a blazer, or dress it down, and you can... The, Yellow bag would go really nicely with that, but I'm really happy about that. I guess that was it. That was what I have bought the last 
past weeks and I just wanted to show you. So that's nothing more to say otherwise than thank you for watching and check out my blog and all the things, the links will be here.